Father Jonathan Morris, and I'm coming to you today on behalf of the Christophers. I'd like to talk to you about heroism. You know, that's maybe the, the greatest adjective somebody can be given. Uh, that man is a hero. Uh, that man uh, or that woman is, has, has done something heroic. Very few times in our lives do we, uh, are we presented with opportunities to be truly a hero in the eyes of the world. Let me tell you of an opportunity that I had uh, to witness other people being heroes. Here at my parish in the Bronx, um, and this, this made news all over the world just uh, this not too long ago, um, there was a pit bull attack uh, by um, a man who was actually doing work at my church, and we had a meeting at 9.30 in the morning, and he was coming to meet with me, and he was attacked by two pit bulls, and to the point of death. As people started watching him be attacked in this vicious way, decisions had to be made. And eventually the neighborhood got in um, and got together and entered with uh, sticks, with water, and got these pit bulls off this man. But there were consequences. Um, more than one person got seriously injured trying to help this man save his own life. Now, what would make somebody do that? I think there's a natural sense of justice that all of us have. And uh, in certain moments, based on one's character, based on um, one's personality, you can overcome the fear in order to achieve that natural justice. But I think there's another level too, and that's what the Christianity brings us. The fact that God has offered us eternal life, that God is the author of justice, that God has given us the possibility of redemption, that God has offered heaven to us when we do the right thing, when we accept his love, when we say yes to his invitation to accept him into our lives, well, that opens up a whole nother realm of possibilities, of reasons why we should be heroic, to be willing to offer our own lives. That's what these people in my neighborhood did in order to save this man, uh, but, you know, I think even if we don't have that type of uh, heroic opportunity, so to speak, I think that Christian uh, heroism can spill over into very ordinary aspects of our lives. Are we willing to lay down our lives for others in very simple things? Doing extra work around the house, saying yes to opportunities of charity, the way in which we use our money, uh, the way in which we use our time, the way in which uh, we help out people who can't help themselves. Heroism in the spiritual life is saying yes to others and putting ourselves in second place. Why? In imitation of what Jesus did for us. Jesus is the ultimate hero because he laid down his life for his friends and also for his enemies. God bless you. For more information on this, go to uh, www.christophers.org.